With just a few simple steps, you can combine two Ethernet connections in your Mac with Speedify for a faster, more reliable connection. And I'm here to show you how. What you'll need, well, a Mac, two internet connections you can use via Ethernet, two Ethernet ports, and, of course, the Speedify app. First, make sure you have the latest version of Speedify installed. You can get it from the Apple App Store. Next, connect your Ethernet connections. Most computers come with only one built-in Ethernet port, if any. So if you're already using that for one of the connections, you're going to need an extra Ethernet to USB or Ethernet to Lightning adapter, something like this. Or if your Mac doesn't have an Ethernet port at all, as has been the trend on laptops lately, you can get a USB Ethernet hub and then an additional one of these adapters plugged into that in order to get two more adapters on the USB. Then just plug in both connections. Here's my Mac. To get more USB ports on it, I have a USB hub here. So I plug in the USB to Ethernet adapter. Then I plug in the second Ethernet to there. And of course I have an ethernet into the back of the Mac itself, giving me two hardware ethernet adapters. If needed, you can confirm your connection status by going to system preferences, click network, and look for your new adapter in the list on the left to make sure both your connections are active. You like this video so far? Subscribe to our channel for more how to's and tech tips and our weekly office hours live stream where we answer your tech questions live. So once you have all the hardware connected, you just run Speedify, make sure you're connected to a server by clicking the switch here if it's not green already. And as soon as you're connected, you'll see all your available connections displayed in the dashboard in different colors corresponding to the colors in the graph. So the green ethernet is the built-in ethernet port. The one I just connected is this sort of purpley USB 10 100 1000 LAN. So you see I have two ethernets both connected to the internet being used at the same time. Since Ethernet is usually unlimited in data and less expensive, both connections are set to the primary priority by default. But if you want it either to be used more than the other or less than the other, you can click on them to adjust the priority. Primary means it's used pretty much all the time. Secondary means it's used a little bit less, used for speed boost if the primary connections are fully busy or not working at all. Backup means it's only used in case of an emergency if the other connections are out. And then never means don't use it at all, which probably isn't what you want. And now with Speedify's pair and share feature, you can add even more connections to the mix wirelessly for an even faster, more reliable bonded connection. So just grab your friend who, you know, has a cellular device or it could be your device that has cellular on it, install Speedify on it, and boom, you will see other devices you can just click on to pair with. And so now I see it here, the Samsung device I just paired with, it shows up as another internet connection that's secondary. So Speedify will try to use those two ethernet ports first, but if something goes wrong with them, they're both connected to Comcast cable. If that goes out, It'll fall back, use the Samsung, reach across the Wi-Fi, and use its cellular in order to keep me online or give me a speed boost if the Ethernets are really, really slow. That's it. Hope it helps. Now that you understand how you can use two Ethernet connections in your Mac and Speedify, check out our other video about the Speedify settings because we explain all the ways you can personalize your app to better suit your preferences for theme, notifications, language, and more so you can get the best possible experience with Speedify.